Hey, what is up everybody? This is John from Magic Tech Review and in today's video, I want to talk a little bit about uh, ZTE Blade Z Max and the messenger kind of issue problem that I'm having on my uh, Blade Z Max. So, uh, it's only on Facebook. So, thus far, obviously, the ZT Blade Z Max has been a great game for me. Also, I do want to talk about the state of mobile gaming uh, just a little bit here after as well. I'm playing The Adventure of Zelda on uh, the Blade Z Max here. So, yeah, uh, if you see some crazy issues right here, this is because it's a mobile game. But either way, guys, I wanted to open up a conversation about the ZT Blade Z Max. And if anybody else is having these issues that I am having, um, although the ZT Blade Z Max is a great phone, and pretty much the only issue I have found is the Messenger. Uh, which I'm going to kind of explain what happens here. So when you go in on your uh, Blazy Max and you go to Messenger and you try to write a message. Now, this doesn't happen every single time. I don't know what triggers it or why it does it, but um, what happens is it makes this like it, it, you start typing. And if you start typing really fast or if you just like come out of another program and you go into it, and you do that then all of a sudden it just closes out which is kind of strange to me so uh yeah and this game is not very well built but anyways so this is uh the adventures of, of zelda but nevertheless um so the blade z max you know and for everybody that's gonna hate on me or whatever because i'm talking about the blade z max um i just want i basically just want to let everybody know about it and plus what I want is to let everybody you know maybe what's going on with it and maybe I I believe that it's a Facebook messenger thing it's a, the message app um, that's going on but it's just quite annoying uh, because it's only happening on my Z Blade Z Max my Blade X Max is fine my ZTE Z Max is fine uh, my Huawei Elite is fine so it just seems like that's like the only one that's doing it uh so hopefully facebook messenger will fix their issues or problems i don't really like messenger per se but i do have a lot of fans and friends on there that i like to chat with and it just kind of annoys me like when you know i open up the facebook messenger and then all of a sudden i start typing and it closes or as well if you if you type and you actually uh or if you make make a message or if you're making like a video message it'll go right out as well so you'll you know you'll be doing like a little video thing right on there to send on a group chat and bam it'll just go cut off and it'll just go to uh the last thing so i don't know i'm just trying to figure out what's going on so maybe collectively you know we could figure out maybe you guys have experienced this maybe you haven't you know maybe it's something I don't know what it is about this messenger thing, but I'd like to fix it. So, yeah. Um, then, also, I want to talk about the state of games on uh, mobile here. So, uh, breaking away from the ZT Blade Z Max and the messenger issues or whatever. Uh, which is not really not, like, the biggest deal in the whole world. Because, obviously, you know, I really like the ZT Blade Z Max. And it's, you know, an awesome phone. And that one little messenger issue is like not that big of a deal but like i said i just want to know if everybody if anybody else is having that issue uh and you know maybe what they might do to fix it or whatever and just so i know that it's just not me going crazy i i have had confirmation of from some other people though that uh they have had the same issue so you know what i'm saying it's not just like me it's me and a couple at least a few other people uh, that I've heard that from. So, now, like I said, I want to move the conversation over to mobile gaming. Uh, so, as you can see here, I'm playing The Adventure of Zelda. Uh, yeah, so, uh, these games, man, they're just like clones of games. And it's just really, really annoying uh, that we have to play these clony games all the time or whatever. And this is nothing like Link or Zelda or whatever. You know, the enemies are not even the right enemies. Uh... There's no progression or whatever. It's just really strange and really weird. So you get these like Zelda clones. 
you get these Mario clones, you get this GTA 5 clones, you get these Pokemon clones. It's like, a, you know, I'm not going to say every single game on the Play Store is clones, but it's like, like, it's like either GTA 5, Zelda, you know, Mario clone, you know, uh, F-Zero clone. It's just like, that's all it is, man. Like, why can't we just get like original games on the Play Store? You know, and they're either free with a whole bunch of ads thrown everywhere in there, or they're microtransaction heavy. You know, why can't it just be like, you know, a free game and then, you know, you can pay to pay to remove the ads or something like that. Or, you know, you can do microtransactions, but you know, have them in, in a in a decent way. Like the microtransactions are just crazy on some of these games and they're like you know they play on the addictive part of gaming where you know you get rewarded for doing certain things and whatnot and it's just really really predatory to me and it just it, it just sucks to see the way mobile gaming is going and the direction that it's going and it just it really saddens me when I go on the play store and I see all these just crap games all over mobile and I don't I just don't see the fix for it you know games like this are just like you know one in a one in a dozen or whatever and I'm pretty sure the developers, you know, they could have made a great game, but they decided to just clone the game that's already out or clone a game that's popular just to get people to download it, you know, so I don't even know what the heck I just did. So, yeah, so there's uh, the falling off of uh, the world. I don't know. But anyways, so, yeah, this is the mobile state of gaming. Uh, Mario clones are just ridiculous like they're just ridiculous then you get Mario clones of Zelda so you have Zelda jumping in a Mario world uh, I mean I don't know what you think guys but leave in the comments below you know what you think about mobile gaming I'd like to actually be able to game on you know mobile and it actually be pretty good uh, there are a few hidden gems uh, that are very 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 hard to find uh, you know but and then they, they usually just microtransaction heavy. That's what they are. They're just trying to get you to spend uh, spend that money when they could just make the game like, you know, a dollar, two, or five, or whatever. But most people are very, they just, you know, they've been, they've been treated to free games, you know, the whole time on the Play Store. And then when you ask them to pay, you know, a couple bucks for a game, they just don't want to do it. So I don't even know what that is on my knee. That's weird. But yeah, guys, so let me know what you guys think about everything. And, uh, wow, this guy's animation is just wild. Uh, the only thing about this game that saves it, in my opinion, is the music. It just has the opening music or whatever, but that's about it. But anyways, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. Go ahead and leave a like on the video. Uh, go ahead and comment, share, and all that goodness. And thank you for the view, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.